co-hosts of Outnumbered, weekends and noon on Fox, and about 7 other thousand jobs here, Emily Campagno. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> right? Joe, no one, you have you ever seen anyone eating a pumpkin? That's the th it's no. You don't have to wait all year. <laughs> A pumpkin was that zoo video and it was a hippopotamus. I agree with you guys. As a white woman, however, I never drink those things. They're beautiful to smell, they're yeah. awesome to think about, but in reality, I have my drip coffee that I have every day. Really amazing. I was on a sugar high probably for about 23 hours. But for, for coffee, I don't agree with this. This is a step in the right direction and it sends a good message, but I think it's sort of futile. And I'm the first person to be anti regulation, but you know, similar to the, the wine sites where you just click a different age, kids will always find a way to get around it. I think there, it will, however, deter a group of kids that will sort of be obedient if members would have and it was to deter and, and prevent them from coming in. So when they saw the little wings on my back, they're like, oh, that's fine. The point is discretion. The point is I remember in 2019 when he filmed a video of himself that said in in sort of retrospect, I have acted inappropriately with women. I will do better. I understand there's now boundaries, something that I haven't observed for the last 50 years in office. Cut to that. Any excuse that man has to put his that man has to put his hands on a woman or a child or a sniff, it's just so unbecoming the office that he occupies. I can't stand it. I, I gotta be honest, I can't see a guy anywhere these days who would be like, there's a existential <laughs> right. I'm dying. You have terminal dying. <laughs> you have existential terminal, terminal dying. dying. <laughs> yes. Your debt your dying's gonna fought. I mean, uh, could you imagine only having to work two days a week? I'd love it. But as a comedian, that's kind of what I... Nothing like that in-person energy, and that's why I think it's position-dependent. And I totally agree with... I mean, I'm sure I'm dating myself and sounding how old I am, but how does that happen over a computer screen? Like, one minute together, to me, is worth more than two hours over emails or the like. Obviously, some positions, sure, stay at home in your pajamas, but I don't understand those generations that live like that. You can't tell jokes with a three-second delay on...